didn't really mention that we were going to Mexico. You've got to intro the vlog. Hello and welcome to the Mexico. That was great. We're just having some breakfast. I've gone for the avocado. Um, it's like avo farmhouse or something like that. And you've just gone for a really boring big breakfast. Hmm? It's quite good. Mm. Mine looks better. Good morning. So I am filming this from sunny Isli Muher. I'm probably saying that wrong. I actually thought it was Isla Muher and then a taxi drive yesterday was like, no, it's Isla. Um, so we are arrived here. Let me just show you the hotel. It is the, I will give you like a proper, it's like Cayman in the background. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop it. He's just gone to the gym and he thinks he's like massive. Um, but anyway, so we arrived late last night, but we were literally absolutely exhausted. Um, so we didn't, I don't feel or anything, we just went for dinner. But yeah, we're really excited to be here. We're actually really sad because there's a turtle farm next door. It got closed at the end of September for, what was it, mismanagement, lootering and... Lootering? Yeah, lootering. Loitering. Or looting. 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 Yeah, looting. Loitering. Looting. Looting. Um, so it's not here anymore which I'm absolutely gutted about because I love turtles and I would have absolutely loved that. But yeah, anyway, we are um, going to pick up the golf buggy now. You can't hire a car on the island or anything. It has to be like a golf buggy or a scooter. So we've had a golf buggy for the next four days. And look over there, I actually, so that's Cancun. I don't know if you can like see it, but it looks like the Miami like coast. But yeah, oh, the sun is kind of creep out. The weather's meant to be like, that's really zoomed in. The weather's meant to be really bad for the next four days. We're really hoping that it's just not the case. It just doesn't happen. So yeah, let's go and pick up the golf buggy. I mean, <laughs> the angle's not very good. I mean, you can probably can't hear us. We've just gone to our breakfast place. Mango candy. But it's really cute, isn't it? This looks. What is this? Coconut French toast, and then quesadillas. Yum. So we're like here in the golf buggy. We had it for like an hour and a half. Just drove back from breakfast, and as we were wearing like, it's not even a hill, is it? Like it started basically broken down and we've just had to push it to the side of the road and now we're waiting for another one to be delivered to us so yeah that's what we're currently doing <sighs> so we've been waiting for how long like an hour it's not here yet for the gold buggy okay we made it nearly two hours later but we are here at the beach club this is called Zara Beach Club. I've ordered a spicy margarita and Kim has ordered, what have you ordered? Salt. But then this is what it looks like, so it's stunning. Like, I mean, how lush. And then it was called pelicans. I think they're pelicans. Yeah, that's fine. spicy. Okay. okay. Thank you. Yes, yes. There's like a thread coming out of my clothes and I thought it was a bug and I started like, uh. trying to grab them all. Something massive or something else is going to go for me. I know, because I have no energy and I'm in a mood. You're going to have to explain what we've done for the rest of the day and where we are. Um, where did I get up to? You can put it on me if you want. Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay. I got up to... Um, 
beach club was the last time. Okay, so after that, we had lunch there. And then... Cold beer, Karen, you're boring and the crowd. The golf buggy to do the supermarket. Oh, yeah. And food. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. And then... Oh, are they yours? And then we stay tacos. Anyway, let's just skip to now. We're at a place called Nomad. It is a beach club, hostel. They're having a white party down there. Too noisy for us. We're old. We are old. I don't know how we're going to eat all those buffalo wings. They smell amazing though. Okay, and then, I don't know if you can see it, but I've gone for a poke bowl. You basically like choose the base, choose the sauce, choose the meat, and then choose loads of veg. So that looks really good. The, the banana, I like that. Oh, right, I've ate. I literally felt like I was going to be sick. Oh my gosh, my knees. Um, right, so this is where we were, Nomad. Some crazy people dancing down there, aren't there? Mm. Having like a white party. I feel like it's a good one for like younger people traveling, but we're a bit like old. old. Okay, oh my goodness. Straight, roundabout, straight. Okay, I'm gonna end the vlog there. I've got mascara down my face, so I need to sort that out. Karen's in the other bed. He's left me for this evening. To be fair, like, we were absolutely boiling last night, so I'm looking forward to bed on my own. Um, but tomorrow we've got a bit more of an exploring day. We're going to see like the multicolored steps, the Islay no hair. I'm gonna figure out how to sleep properly. It's Karen just getting ready for bed. Um, and just, yeah, there's like a co-working space that's sort of like a beach club. It looks really cool. But anyway, we're going to go there. So yes, good night. And that was our first full day. Okay, good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Kieran. His light is making me look blue. Um, we are going today to, is it called downtown? It's like the main town like where the ferry port is and where everything is it's raining today so i thought it was quite a good day to like explore like things rather than like a beach club but we are stopping at like a co-working beach club place called and um, thanks called lotus hotel um which has a beach club within it called guru um so we are going to stop there just because it's literally like where we're going i'm on the hunt for some white crocs i mean any color will do preferably white i'm really angry that i didn't bring mine but we move, we move on. Could have bought them instead of your hairdryer. Oh, I know. Yes, this thing that I tried to, oh, I tried, to, I basically bought my Dyson hairdryer thinking like it's a good hairdryer, it'll make my hair, you know, because every, you wash your hair pretty much every day on holiday, don't you? And it didn't work with the adapter. And then I Googled it and you can't take them abroad. Dyson, their solution, they recommend you to buy another one so you can take it abroad with you. That's literally what it says on their website. I don't really know who would do that. So yeah, it's really annoying because it's heavy. It took up space. I had to leave my Crocs behind. And then I realized I actually need Crocs um, for like when we're doing the yoga in the morning and stuff. But anyway, on the hunt for some, um, if not just some like decent sliders will do. Not decent sliders, like any sliders. <laughs> but yeah, that is the plan for today. decaf coffee which I'm regretting now because I'm, I'm yawning. Sugar. Yours is cute. It's like a little... Is it sage green? Close. Right, we're going to go for the enchiladas with mixed sauce. Cider treats though. And then you've gone for... What have you gone for? You've gone for this, haven't you? 
Them pancakes look so fluffy. Wow. The pancakes look amazing. Beautiful. <laughs> Oh, and then you're just gonna tuck in like that. What? We've just come into like a massive, like massive shop um, on the hunt for Crocs. And yeah, if we don't have them in here, then I don't know where they are. They don't have them on the island. Oh, oh, we're in the shoe part. I mean. Yeah, they've got those. Come on, see if they've got your side. I cannot put my feet in there. How adorable is that little turtle? Oh! No, I didn't have any. They've got small crocs. If you had my size, I'd get them. Oh, Karen's found. Chocolate, strawberry. How much are these? You have the free tasting. You have the free tasting and then you have a 20% off in any bottle that you like to take. Okay, how much are these? They cost to you normally 2,200 pesos. No, 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 too much. What? Do you want to try one or not? We're not gonna, I'm not going to buy one. Uh, I'm good. I'll try, I'll try a little. Yeah, this is, let me tell you something. This stuff, my friend, this is not like the, like the gasoline you're trying home. <laughs> yeah, let me tell you about it. I have a banana, almond, chocolate. This is pistachio. Yeah. It's not bad. That's why. That's why the price. Yeah. I know you can have like a very, very cheap kind of tequila at home for a lot of less money, but trust me, they don't taste, they don't taste in the same in the kind of world. Okay. Oh, how dreamy would a massage be there? I definitely want a massage from there. We stopped. I'm on a swing. Take zero stop, isn't it? You're gonna change, mate. Stop <laughs> What was that? Mm. Hey, he can see. Oh, got some bites. Blood. Oh, I found some crocs. He went in and I was like, asked some crocs, and he had like loads of kids ones. And then basically, we're waiting for like, I don't know, someone to go and get something somewhere. And the next thing you know, he turns up with some crocs. So I've got some crocs, and I've also got a really nice cover up for which um, I think will be amazing for two. Yeah. Okay, so we've just stopped at a circle beach club. There's no one here at the moment, but we're not staying here for long. We're literally just staying here for a drink. Um, but yeah, it's right opposite, like the main, like the only like big all the hotel that like, there is on the island, which is this one. I think it's called Mia. But look, look how gorgeous that is. Our golf buggy, which Kieran has named what? A banana? Huh? The banana. The banana. And then we're looking at the rainbow steps. They're disappointing. Well, they're just, they are what they are, they're like rainbow jet. steps. Yeah, they are, but they're cool. We'll get a little photo and then go. So I'm sat in the back, and Kieran decided he's going to take us somewhere like a on Google Maps. Now we're going down this road, which I am not happy about.
looks amazing. The shrimp to starter. And then we've got, should I just put them in the middle on the, on the bed, Kieran? Yeah. The beef nachos, like, look how incredible they look. Oh, there's a fly. <sighs> that looks so good. We've moved location, and as you can hear, it's absolutely chucking it down. I mean, I don't even think you can see that. No, you can. We're just enjoying the Malibu and Coke. Oh, now we're getting wet. So we are now ready for the evening. Um, oh, I feel so like hot and exhausted. So we've just gone to a restaurant um, just for a drink before we actually go for dinner. It's not a photo. Um, no, it's for like the steakhouse or something. But anyway, yes, it's also a mixology bar. The cocktails look really good. Really, like unusual things. I've gone, hang on, yeah. I've gone for a bee's knees, lemon honey syrup and champagne. And then Kieran has gone for this one, which is because Honey Girl. Out of which two? What is that one? Honey Island. Oh yeah. Hmm. Tough choice. Right, so I'm going to end my vlog here because I am absolutely drenched. We just drove a golf buggy. Like, okay, Kieran, come and show them the example of your top in the golf buggy. Yeah. <laughs> Great demonstration. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm so drenched. And it was like hitting me. It was hurting. Oh gosh. And then we came back and the room isn't even, um, what'd you call it? Heating was not. He wasn't on. I'm so cold. I'm just going to say goodnight. Good morning. Is it a good morning, Karen? Yeah, great morning. Great. We are, thankfully it's not raining today. Um, we have just golf buggied into the old town. We're going to get some breakfast and then we're going to go to a beach club called um, Green Demon. Not a very nice name. Is it open for breakfast? Well, it's got pictures of breakfast on it. So we're going to a place called North Garden, um, which I've been wanting to go to. I wanted to go to dinner last night, but we just closed. This food looks so good. Look at the French toast cappuccino. Them hotcakes are well nice. Three delicious pancakes topped with Nutella and fresh bananas. And it's really cute as well. It's all like jungly. I don't know what to get. Bagel. Mm. Gone for a green juice and a latte. Oh, yes. That looks really like inappropriate. <laughs> okay, the food's come and it's literally mahusive. sheltering from the rain. It's not what we ordered. Okay, so we are at Green Demon Beach Club. We've actually been here for the past like hour, but when we arrived, it was chucking it down um, still. So we've just been sat at like the beach bar um, there. I had a, what was it, a spiced mango margarita. That was really good. I just love anything that's like coated with that like tajin salt. So nice. 
Um, and now the weather has, like, it's not raining, but it's not sunny. So anyway, we've sat on a bed and yeah, we're just, I mean, the sea's warm, isn't it? It was, it was pretty warm. Yeah, it, it was pretty warm. So I'm gonna try and actually have a swim because I haven't had a swim holiday yet. Um, but I'll show you anyway, it's really nice. And you can actually walk like 100 meters out. Like it's still only up to like the shins. 100? What would you say then? <laughs> All right, sorry, 50 or 60. And also, this is a part where there's like not any seaweed really at all. Just obviously, awareness. We abandoned it. It was raining. Ordered some food, some fries. I'm going for a banana banana cocktail. It's the amaretto banana syrup and rum. Um, These are so good, aren't they? Normal here activities are around. Okay. Even though I'm actually quite full after those chips, I've got beef carpaccio and then chicken nachos. Oh, gracias, señor. One corona. Thank you. Spice mango margarita. Do you want me to take the cup? Or not yet? I'll have another couple. Yes, of course. No worries. What are you doing? <laughs> What is so funny? Is it appropriate? Yeah. Hi, part of the Philosopher's Stone turns 20. Where are they now? It's <laughs> given their exact coordinates. Yeah, it's given the coordinates. Hmm? So I still feel stuffed from my food. From Hello. your nachos? From my nachos. Because you bailed early on the nachos, so I have to just try and make a dent. <laughs> Yeah. On the way to the golf buggy. It's where we were yesterday, isn't it? So this here is a hotel called Lotus. Who got so much rules? So it pulls. Yeah, no, I, I get you. I get you. Oh yeah, they need some maintenance. These are cute though, little teepee things. Oh, pigeons! They're actually they are not pigeons. They're seagulls. There's a noise there. Good evening. I'm just moving myself through um, the doors. So this evening we have had a really chilled evening actually. We have gone... Yes, yeah, so we went back from Green Demon, the beach club, which was really like I can see the potential of it on like a really sunny day. Like it was a really nice beach club. And the guy there was called Hemi and he was just so lovely, so welcoming, amazing. Um, and they just came back here and chilled. Um, we went to the rooftop bar for a little bit. Um, yeah, and then basically you have to hire out jacuzzis here. There is like free jacuzzis. You have to hire them. Um, oh, my camera lens is a little bit funny in the humid heat, but so just bear with. Not really much better, is it? <laughs> okay. Um, but anyway, so yeah, then this evening we had this booked, so. We have just been in this. I don't know, something's wrong with my camera, I think. Um, because we booked it through my back office, because I have a travel business, um, we actually had like a VIP upgrade. So we were in like a balcony room, we had 20% um, off everything that we stayed here because we just did room only because we wanted to like explore the island and eat there and stuff. Um, and then we had sparkling wine included as well. So we had that tonight, redeemed it in the hot tub. So that was really nice. We were going to go to the Old Town tonight and um, go to food there again. I keep saying Old Town, it's just downtown. It's not like an old town and there's a new town, it's just the town. Um, but we both kind of made the mutual decision that like we're pretty tired and the food here is really good so we're just gonna eat here and i feel very good about that decision and now i now have a glass of wine on the balcony good morning i don't think you can actually see me um got a little passenger today our washing ah uh, just washing okay. <laughs> oh it's finally sunny today, so we're hoping it stays out. Ah. Kieran looks like a little traveller. <laughs> Stop. 
up for breakfast. Ben's place called Roosters. It looks good. I've got a Hawaiian, yeah, Hawaiian Tropic coming. There you go, Brewster. They are blaring music next door. The Stevie's have arrived. Have you gone for a mango? Oh my gosh, this is so good. It's like a Spanishy ex Benedict. You've got for an omelette, haven't you? Mm. Oh my gosh, I can't actually see. I'm so sort of naked. Um, but we are, the sun is out, yay. Um, we are just at the hotel beach now, which is so nice. Like, it's just, it's beautiful because the sun's out. It looks amazing. I mean, it's beautiful anyway, that's not what I meant. But, like, hello, we've got this little cabana. Stunning, right? I'm just reading my book. The book that I'm reading is this one. So absolutely loving it. And yeah, we've moved location, haven't we? The sun was out earlier. No, it's not. We've gone for one of these things. So, a whole watermelon. Six to two. Do you reckon I make a counter off or just reject that? See if they go off. I'll just reject it. Yeah, reject. Tuck in. <laughs> Oh, that's dangerous because it just tastes like watermelon. Mm. That's nice. That's good. Very good. With a lot of alcohol. It just tastes like watermelon, though. <laughs> <laughs> 